Don't get up. Before we start, let me be blunt. The only way I see you getting out is if you admit guilt. I don't care if it's not true, if it was an accident. You gotta say you did it on purpose. Do I need to repeat myself? No, it's just, you know what I expected. What does that mean? Your husband's kind of vanilla. And? You seem the opposite of vanilla. Neither of us are vanilla. You guys got kids? Trying. What was the problem? Is junk not work? Sexual advance on a female guard, inciting a fight in your cell block. Only a moron commits these kinds of infractions when you're up for parole. Or you just don't want out at all. Which is it? I've always been kind of a moron. Your phone rang. Laura? No. You sure you don't want the ashes? I mean, we can cook them into slop, feed it to pigs, or just spread them in the worst place imaginable. My sister might actually take them. Oh, so your sister showed up? Yeah, she's here now. Oh, then go. I'll talk to you later. It's fine. How are you? Great. I have the whole house to myself this weekend. I'm gonna eat and watch bad movies. You saw the list of AA meetings I left on your desk? Bonnie, just go and be with your sister. Thanks. Come home with me. What? She needs to hear you say it. That Sam forced you to keep it from her. Could have told her anyway. And you couldn't. Because Sam got into your head. Just like he did to me. This is a woman who wants me dead. Because she blames you for the baby, and that's fair. You know that. Of course I do. Then come home and tell her that. She'll forgive you. You just need to forgive her first. <laughs> 